in Connecticut, and uh, here's, this is just like, what, two days ago. Here's what happened. Hi, I'm in Westport, Connecticut, at the evil underground lair of Martha Stewart. <laughs> All right, it's not evil and it's not underground, but it is where Martha Stewart makes her television show and has her company. I'm going to tape a segment with Martha, and I'm also going to get a tour. This could be fun. Let's go inside. Martha Stewart has conquered the world on three fronts. First off, she dominates the media with magazines, television shows, and an aggressive internet marketing operation. Next, of course, her famous fudge empire, featuring products made with fudge, such as shoes, Ouija boards, radios, bike tires, and baby pools. Third, Martha Stewart's international car theft ring, where she personally steals and resells Audis, Vegas, and of course, all makes and models of the Ford Taurus. <laughs> Yet Martha doesn't stop there. Her true wealth comes from worldwide operations in money laundering and big tobacco. I'm standing in uh, Martha Stewart's impressive Westport, Connecticut complex. This yes. is amazing. This is like something a Bond villain would have inside a volcano. <laughs> Men in jumpsuits taking over the world. It's really fantastic, though. Would you give us a tour? Sure. What an amazing kitchen. I've never seen a kitchen where someone, a human being, can actually lie down. I mean, this is, this we is can, amazing. We can do, we can do autopsies. <laughs> you do autopsies here. Yeah, okay, we can do cadaver explorations. This is all stuff we never see on the show. <laughs> I've never seen so much counter space. Look, every kind of form. That's cookie cutters. Cookie cutters. This is... Uh, Makes an Al Roker cookie. This is beautiful. <laughs> you, got, you got a Abraham Lincoln snowman. Every kind of form. This don't, is don't to make, mess it up. These are oh, you're are they in a certain order? Well, you're yeah, you're messing up. That makes you crazy, doesn't it? Yep. The whole idea. <laughs> the whole idea. <laughs> Does this ever happen to you? I'm curious. You turn on the griddle. You forget it's on. Someone's talking to you, and you say, "Wait a minute. What I wanted to tell you was." <laughs> And then you have to reach around for a spatula and then get your hand off. No. And you go, no. No. What's this right here? Well, I like different kinds of salt. So we have about six or seven different varieties of salt. I didn't know there salt. were. I thought salt was just salt. Oh, no, taste. But wet your finger. One, one finger, a little bit. Just a teeny bit. No, just dip lightly, lightly, lightly. Okay. This is gray sea salt, French, mm. from Brittany. What do you think? Salty. Okay, I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna another finger. This is. Tell me if it's saltier. Salty. Saltier? Salty. I can't tell. I don't have a palate. Here, try this one. I just eat like. This is black salt. I eat chunks of potato. You this know, is black salt. all the time. Wait, that's pepper. Black I just, salt. Oh, I just wanted to see if you could tell the difference. I'm not retarded. Look at these. You just run your hands around the pots and go, so many copper pots. So many copper pots. Arr, I'm a pirate. Arr. So we have refrigerators, all kinds of stuff. All, everything homemade, by the way. Look. Look at this. Homemade. Jams, homemade. jellies. Look homemade. at this. Quinces. A human brain. No, no, that's preserved quince. What's quince? Quince is that apple pear that grows in the fall. Greenish, very fragrant. I don't know what you're talking about. This is the prep kitchen where it's everybody, Sarah and Jen and Hello, Lucinda. Hello. You can have anything you want. This is a great place to work. And explain here, I've been told there's a rumor that these giant ducks in the ceiling are bringing gravy into the building. I have no idea. Okay, so over here is my office. Is this, is this antique or is this, you had this made? Oh no, this is, these are all, you know, 50s, 40s, 50s, 60s. What's this? Oh look, something from the White House. Oh, the Christmas card from the last year of the Clintons. That's very nice. Yeah. I didn't get one of those. No, you didn't get one? No. Right. Papal blessing. Oh, this is a papal blessing yeah. for you? Yeah, here's, here's oh, Pope John. He's blessed me. So this means you get right into heaven. You just show Martha that at the Stewart gate. Martha Stewart and family blessed by Pope John. That's great. Could yeah. I just borrow that? No. <laughs> Do 
Guess who's coming to dinner? Well, late night host Conan O'Brien stops by to get some easy entertaining tips, including my secret recipe for baked Alaska. What do okay. I do? Well, these are something Ooh. that we learned about. You like that? That's very sensual. Right. These are these fabulous new little molds. This is a flexible silicone material. Completely oh, that's silicone. I knew I had felt this right. before. <laughs> I like to watch things burn. Oh, okay. I usually set the fire, wait till the trucks come, watch it burn, and then leave quietly. He's just joking everybody out there. He is a comedian. You must know that. Oh, yeah. We need three more. Three more. Okay. Huh? We were huh? doing it just right. Do that. What? We're not going to quite get 12 perfects. We're going to get no, maybe... No, I guess I let you down. Do you have any booze here? No, absolutely not. Why? Oh, wait, this is not a... What is this? That's a pot holder. Look, mine has little ah. spikes. It looks like an aging Don King. Look what I got. That's right. A torch and a hat. <laughs> die, Meringue, die! I can't get it in. This well, is, this I is just want to thank you. Lick, lick your lips, please. Mm, okay. That's what's that. Mm. Thank you, Lassie, with Conan. Mm. It's a great thing. It's a great thing. Boom, oh, and he caught the pot! Yeah. Well, thanks to uh, Martha Stewart. She's always a good sport. Uh, we're taking a break. We come back. Ted Danson is here. Stick around. Yeah.